Oh yes. Welcome to Sammy Eats. Today is my Q&A video. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be reading out questions you lot have asked me. I've got Domino's pepperoni. Pepperone. It's their vegan version. They've also given me a vegan garlic and herb dip as well. I've got the actual garlic and herb dip because this one bangs. Let's check it out. You know when she gave me the box, I was like, what the hell is in this? There's nothing in here. It feels like air. It feels like absolute air. Okay. Oh, there goes the dip. Right. Let me spread this open. Might fall off. This is it, opened. Um, I'm gonna actually open this as well, see what this tastes like. It smells the same. Don't know why I wouldn't, but okay. Anyways, I think first of all, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, check out my other videos, follow my Insta, follow my TikTok, follow everything. I'm gonna first try a slice and then I'll start answering the questions. God, this does not look right at all. I'm not gonna lie, look how thin this pizza is. What the hell is that? Oh, some bloody biscuit pizza. Tastes like pizza. I can't tell the difference. Am I meant to be able to? I don't think so. It's just really thin, which I don't think it should be. I feel like they mugged me off. But today, they said on the app, any size pizza, they said on the app, any size pizza, six ninety nine. This sauce is right. Mmm, too tangy. Pizza's good. Not gonna lie. Pizza does need more cheese on this though. Way more cheese. I think I'm gonna open this one because this one tastes way better. Oh, yeah. I love this stuff. This stuff. This stuff is amazing. This is this camera's gonna piss me off today because it keeps leaning forward. And I have no idea why I keep doing this. It's actually trying to mug me off. It's actually mugging me off. All right, let's get this Q and A going because before all shit starts going crazy. Right, question number one: Will you be doing Ramadan mukbangs? I completely forgot how close Ramadan is. Okay, Ramadan, Ramadan, Ramadan is in about three weeks, um, so very close. And yes, I will be doing Ramadan mukbangs again. Um, probably will be a similar food you saw last year, but we're gonna do it anyway. Mm. Oh bloody hell, it's bent. I'm gonna shoot someone. I don't know if that's better, but I can't see a damn thing. Question number two, more uploads. Yes, there will be more uploads. At the minute, I'm just really busy. Um, I am gonna try getting back to one video a week. What is your favorite video and why? My favourite video is probably any of the Indian curry ones because they're banging. I love making them, I love eating them. This is really tangy. If you had to open a restaurant or takeaway, which cuisine would it be? Either fast food, that's not cuisine, but whatever. Or Indian food. Indian slash Bengali food. Next question. Which celebrity would you like to meet? I don't know. Which celebrity? Which celebrity would I like to meet? I have no idea which celebrity I'd like to meet. Someone who I really like, obviously. Who, what music am I listening to? Recently? I think... Celebrity. I think... I would have loved to have met Bob Proctor. He's actually passed away recently. I would have loved to have met Bob Proctor. Google him. He's not a celebrity, but still. Next question. What is your pin number? All right, mate. Next question. I know who asked this question. Your favorite thing about me? My favorite thing about you is every time we meet, we always laugh. Same person asked, what is your least favorite thing about me? You are definitely the most annoying person I've ever met. And you don't know when you're being annoying. And if you were a guy, I'd punch you in the face repeatedly. 
Yeah. I don't know what's wrong with this tripod today. Bloody piece of shit. Can't believe I never knew about this. And the person who told me about this, good taste. What motivates you? Depends on what it is. What motivates me to make these videos, if that's what you meant. I like seeing my progress, seeing what my videos were like and what they are like now. What I used to speak about or not speak about or didn't speak at all to compared to what I am speaking about. Basically, I like seeing the progress that I make through these videos. Most of you guys who have me on Instagram reach out and message and we message. Um, we talk about food, which is probably the best thing ever. It allows me to speak about what I think of a specific restaurant or whatever, takeaway that I've reviewed or whatever. Anything like that. If you are a vegan, you should get this pizza. It's, it's, it's not bad. It's a really thin pizza. I don't know if they've done that because they've got this offer on today. Or... Or because this is how it comes. Give it a go, but ask for extra cheese. Good, make a video, man. Next question. What is your favourite book? This is a very good question. I have loads of favourite books, but my favourite book, nah. You can't make me pick a favourite book. Is that asking me to pick a favourite song? Doesn't work. My favourite books, number one, The Alchemist. Number two, Man's Search for Meaning by Viktor Frankl. Number three, favourite book, uh, what else have I read? I've read so many books, I don't know. But those two definitely, they're, just, they're the only ones that come to my mind. Like, I've read The Secret, Simon Sinek, Start With Why, that was a really good book. What else, what else, what else, what else, what else? Loads of books. But they're the ones that come to my head right now. Next flipping question. Where do you want to be right now? What? There's a ghost in here, I don't want to be in here. Where do you want to be right now? This camera's pissing me off. I would love to be in a hot country where you can feel the sun on your skin. Somewhere warm, obviously. I like warm places. Warm country. So, <laughs> Dubai for me. It's, for me, it's always Dubai. Next question. Gym goals. My gym goal is literally get lean. That is it. I want to stay this size, but be lean. So what I need to do, I need to sort my diet out and literally just push it on the weights, eat more protein. Uh, yeah. This is a good one. What do your parents think about your channel? My parents absolutely love my channel. They are my biggest fans. They've always supported me through this, whatever I do. Um, they really enjoy it. They know about my views before I do. They've got nothing against it. My parents are supportive with anything I do. My parents like my videos. That's it. Next question. This question is all over social media. Are there more doors in the world or more wheels? Listen, I have no idea, obviously. Massive debate, which one would it be? What kind of wheels? Tires on a car? Wheels on, on your computer chair? Steering wheels, does that count? Doors, do fridge doors count? I need to know. Cars have four wheels, some cars. I don't even get, oh yeah, whatever. Cars have four wheels, four doors. Does a boot door count? What counts? I don't know. An apartment, for example, an apartment, a block of flats, they've got hundreds of doors. How many cars are there in the world? I don't know. I don't even know how many people drive. I know, I think, I think there's 20 million cars in the UK. That's a lot of wheels and doors. You answer that. What is there more of in the world? More cars or more doors? Let me know in the comment section. Oh my God, I pretty much answered all these questions already. Let's slow it down. I'm gonna eat some and then I'm gonna answer questions. This is Tangy, the vegan one. Don't get that. Unless you're vegan. It's honestly not bad. It needs more cheese. These these are really thin slices. This pizza was not difficult to eat at all. 
Hmm. Let me ask some more questions. Favorite quotes. Consistency is more important than perfection. The same water that hardens the egg softens the potato. It's not about the circumstances, it's about what you're made of. That's a really important one. Don't be afraid to leave the good to go for the great. Doubt your doubts and believe your beliefs. Jim Rohn. The next quote is another one of my favourites. It's from Rocky, when Rocky's talking to his son. It's not about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. And then obviously he says some other stuff like, if you know what you're worth, go out and get what you're worth, which is very important. The last quote I have, and this is probably one of the best, success is a bit like being pregnant. In the end, everyone says congratulations, but nobody knows how many times you got f <laughs> Next question is most embarrassing thing you've done. Whenever anyone asks me this, I always say the same thing. I've done so many embarrassing things in my life, but whenever someone asks me this, this one story stays in my head. Let me put these down here. Bring the pizzas up here so you can see them. Right, let me tell you the story. Once upon a time, I had just finished uni um, and I got on the underground to go home. When you got on the underground, if you sat down, um, you'd obviously let like a pregnant person, elderly person, someone with like a disability, uh, sit down uh, and take your space. So what happened was, this is embarrassing. A blind person came onto the train and I was sat down and obviously I wasn't thinking at the time and I tried making eye contact with them to see if they wanted to take my seat. The problem with that is you cannot make eye contact with a blind person. And that was embarrassing. Obviously here's me trying to make eye contact with the blind person to see if they want to take my seat. Um, and yeah, that was it. Luckily, no one saw um, and obviously they definitely didn't see me. That is probably the most embarrassing thing that I've ever done. But to be honest, embarrassing is probably more in your head than anything else. I guess you decide what's embarrassing or not. But yeah, that was, if it wasn't embarrassing, it was bad. I, sh I didn't mean to do that, obviously. Anyways, back to the pizza. I tried helping out, that's... Last question. Does money buy happiness? Does money buy happiness? Um, some people say yes, some people say no. But this is my Q&A, so obviously you want my answer. Money does not buy happiness. Money makes your life easier. Happiness is always, is always in your head. You obviously decide what makes you happy or not. If you think, oh, I'm going to buy a car which makes you happy, then yeah, I guess money does buy happiness. Um, but I know loads of people who have got loads of things, loads of materialistic things. Anything you could ask for, everything you could ask for, they've got it, they're still not happy. I think it's the things, the little things that make you happy. I heard someone say, money does buy happiness, you just have to give it away, which is really important. Giving things away or getting things for people, buying things for people will always make you happy, 100%. I'm 50-50 with it. Money can buy you experiences and your experiences make you happy. Pay for a holiday and that holiday made you happy but overall money doesn't buy happiness happiness is all in your head the best way to stay happy is well this is why i think being happy and content um stay grateful be happy in the position you are in because there's someone in the world who would love to be in the position you are in now and they would probably do a better job at that position than you are. Be grateful. You might not like where you live. Some people don't have a house. You might not like the food you're eating. Some people have no food. Always be grateful for everything you have. That's the best way to stay content and happy. That doesn't mean don't strive for more. We should always push ourselves to our maximum. and See what we can achieve. See what we can do. Always appreciate where you are. Always realise and be grateful for how far you've come and keep striving to be better. Oh, yeah. There's many things that can make you happy to be honest, but being grateful I think is the key to happiness. For me anyway. If you want to buy a Mercedes and you think that's going to make you happy, try it. 
If it makes you happy, it makes you happy. It's a very good question. It's currently 10 p.m. And I'm here eating a vegan pizza. I don't know what this song is on their pizza, bro. I think Pizza Hut pizza is better. I'm going to end the video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. Follow my TikTok, follow my Insta. Check out my other videos. Please make sure you subscribe. More things coming soon, and I'll see you later.